Hey guys, welcome back to our channel. You may think that we are in the Dolomites with these type of mountains, but we are in Switzerland and we are in Leukerbad this weekend. This is one of my favorite thermal spa stations in Switzerland. There are lots of different swimming pool and hot water to try with thermal water. There's also skiing and more involved, so stay tuned and let's get into it. So this is the continuation of our Where the Swiss Go on vacation. Lokobad is one fan favorite, but you don't really hear it that much. So I wanted to share it with you. We are going to take our little daughter to the thermal bath and going to go skiing, sledding, and explore some Swiss traditions. Stay tuned and let's go. Leukerbad is located in the canton of Valle. By public transportation, it's most easily accessed from the city of Bern, where you can arrive in approximately an hour and 45 minutes via train and then finally a connecting bus for the last leg of the journey. Leukerbad is a favorite destination of the Swiss for its healing properties of their thermal waters, which were beloved dating all the way back to the Romans. Every day, nearly 4 million liters of 51 degrees Celsius thermal water flows into Leukerbad, supplying the various thermal baths in the village. Apart from being an amazing spa and wellness destination, Leukerbad offers ample opportunities for skiing or hiking depending on the season so beautiful thing about Lokobad and this is why I wanted to show this place is look at these cliffs and mountains that are surrounding the village it's just incredible and you have also some cute chalets etc but look at these mountains So now we're heading to our hotel to check in. It is conveniently located in the village next to a spa and gondolas. So we just arrived at our hotel. We have the room that's like a family kind of apartment style, which is nice. When we have the baby with us, it's more space. So right off the entrance, you have the first bathroom, balcony, nice sofa, nice little eating area, which we'll take advantage of. Then you have a beautiful bed with the wood paneling. There's another balcony. And then my favorite part, I'll show you guys. Here, we have another bathroom with the bathtub. It's exciting. So the nice thing about the Quellenhof is that you are right next to the Alpen Thermen, which are the thermal baths here. This is one of the two big ones. And then you also, that's for later, right there at the end of the street, you have the gondola to go skiing or just hiking during the summer, so that's also pretty nice. So we are walking, it's about five minutes to go to the Leukerbad turns. You have also the other one that we'll show you right next to the hotel, but we have that beautiful view when we walk and uh, we are going to enjoy some uh, hot springs. So when you're in here, there's a bunch of different changing rooms. You can go in and then you have a wristband that you can open these little lockers and leave your stuff and get ready for the bath. And also something cool, if you stay at the hotel, the Quellenhof gave it to us, you have a guest card and you can have some discounts and you can even buy the pass directly at the Quellenhof or at your hotel. So with 10 pools and multiple different water attractions, the Leukerbad Terme is actually the largest alpine thermal spa in all of Europe. And this one is great if you have kids because they accept children of all ages, whereas some other public thermal spas in Leukerbad are for children ages eight and up. As you can see, there are water slides and all kinds of activities. Kids, adults, everyone can have a great time here and you can really spend a whole day. So we are at the family pool at the fifth floor. There's a bunch of swimming pools and lots of stuff for the kids. Of course, for adults, you can go downstairs and you have that beautiful pool. There's also for adults and kids, I guess, the toboggan that is really fun actually. So I definitely recommend uh, coming here. So these were the Leukerbad Terms, which was really cool. If you have kids, this is some, somewhere you can stay the whole day, you can eat there. You can have fun and you have these amazing views on the mountains. 
look at this it's like really grand kind of all around us for dinner, we headed back to the restaurant in our hotel and it's absolutely beautiful. We just love the ambiance, but was delicious. This is actually a tartare specialty restaurant. So all kinds of tartare, whether it's beef, fish, even they had vegetarian options. So if that's something that interests you, we definitely recommend trying it out. So I'm going to take advantage of a little bath just just here in the evening where still the views on the mountains as it's a minute away <laughs> so right next to our hotel was the Valliser Alpenterme so this one is open to ages eight and up so we couldn't take our daughter here but Louis had an experience here by himself and loved it this one has a beautiful panoramic pool and if you're interested they also have a sauna village with over 300 square meters of different kinds of saunas that you can enjoy. So this one has a little bit more of a spa feel than the Leukerbad Terme which we think was great for families. Good morning from our hotel and some views on the mountains that are gonna get better I think as the day goes by. So we are now walking to go take the gondola in Gemi. This one goes every 30 minutes, every 0, 0 and 30, so plan for it. But look at these mountains here. And uh, let's walk in the village. So the walk to the Gemi gondola station was about 15 minutes and it was almost entirely uphill, so that's just something to know depending on what you're planning to take up there with you. The gondola leaves every 30 minutes or every 10 minutes during the peak peak times, but generally every 30 minutes and then you take the gondola all the way up to 2,350 meters. So we are now at the Gemi. This is one of the two gondolas from Lokobad, and this is, for me, my favorite. It's so beautiful. We have the Daubenze here. We'll show you that you can luge, you can walk around, and it's just pristine, and you have amazing views all over. So let's show you the Gemi. And you have a grand tour of Switzerland thing and a very cute old gondola for the Gemi. And in there actually you can see that we can see from here the Matterhorn that is on the other side. Sort of over there, I think it's, a, it's just, maybe you can see the point of it, yeah. This is the Matterhorn there. All right, so I think the Gemi wins the best views already on the way in and now from here you can go If you're interested, there's actually a little gondola at the Gemi that goes down about 150 meters to the Daubenzee. This is a beautiful tiny little lake that is frozen over in the winter, but you could see it beautifully in the summer. And we actually just thought the gondola experience was really fun. So it takes you down and then you're in this totally pristine area where you can walk, take a little luge, or just kind of explore and hike around the lake. And we were with our daughter, so we went down with the gondola that you can see here but you have a whole luge slope here you can go sledding and uh, have a lot of fun like these people did so you can walk on these paths that are paid for you and you can go all around the lake there over there you have Sundbühl which is close to Kandersteg and Oceansee actually so very close, these Valis Alps and the uh, Berne Oberland Alps. All right, I left uh, our baby on access to nap and I'm going to go ski. This is just 200 meters away from the hotel, the Torrent Gondola Station for the skiing. So I'll show you what you can do skiing and the views you can have skiing or hiking Oops. <laughs> during the summer. All right, let's go. Happy Louis <laughs> going skiing. If I can steal a few hours of skiing every weekend, that's already a win. So let me show you what there is to do in Leukebad skiing. And it's uh, every 20 minutes, bad luck. I just arrived a minute too late, I think, but uh, we'll see it go up and then 
I'll take the next one. Some beautiful snow sprinkled on the trees with these cliffs. It's cool, you have like this whole circus of cliffs the whole way around Lokobad, which is really, really nice. All right, let's ski a little bit in Lokobad. Woohoo! So it's very cool, you ski basically up the cliff and you have the beautiful view on the mountains there. And uh, as you're very high up, you have just good snow. It's absolutely amazing there are the birds singing. You see the mountains that are not hiding anymore. And I'm going all the way down to Flaschen, which is another little village right next to Leukobad. And apparently there is a cool event there. So let's see if I can show it to you guys. This is this region's tradition. Suspense. <laughs> so I'm in Flaschen, just uh, 15 minutes early, but uh, you might have already a hint on what's going to happen here. With these cows bells, <laughs> we're going to have some cows quotation mark fighting because it's not really a fight it's which one is the most afraid <laughs> and we're going to have it in the snow in here cheese on the rusty. <laughs> there is the last World Cup of the season here with our Marco Automat, but this is super cute here. Look at this. Oh, and wood. All right, thank you so much for watching. This was a blast here in Leukerbad. I definitely recommend this place, not only in the winter, but also in the summer if you like hiking. This is really a paradise for hikers. There is a Via Ferrata. There are amazing views. So definitely consider coming to Leukerbad also in the summer. This is it for us. Thank you so much for watching and see you in the next video. Bye guys. Hey guys, thanks for watching. Thanks for watching. If you want to see more videos like this, please make sure to like and subscribe. We'll see you soon.